Okay. <laughs> okay, could I take you to uh, roads in the Northern Territory, please? Central Arnhem Road and the Buntine Highway. Uh, has the business case uh, with detail costings been finalised for Central Arnhem Road? The Northern Territory Government has um, started early planning for that corridor um, and will be developing an investment strategy um, for a, a rolling program um, to upgrade that road over a number of years. What about the Buntine Highway? Um, similar similar um, for the Buntine Highway, Senator. So when do you think it will be completed in terms of that uh, early planning? We understand they um, they will be completing that in not eighteen nineteen for both roads. Eighteen. They'll be completing Next the financial planning. Year. Yes. Yeah. And will that be publicly available? Um, I'll have to take that on notice, Senator. Okay. Um, so the planning will be completed eighteen nineteen. What about the works? Um, the works are currently profiled over quite a number of years, Senator. Um, beyond the Ford estimates as well. Okay, can you give me an indication of those years? Um, so, uh, Senator, we'll be um, undertaking all of the roads of strategic importance and all of the corridor work in a very similar way to how we've undertaken the works on the Midland um, Highway in Tasmania, where we will be working up a package of works um, with the state government. Um, to determine um, and we, uh, how we want to actually spend the funding and prioritise it in according to need of safety and productivity. Okay. I'd still like the answer, though, in terms of timing, uh, when the works will be completed over those forward years. What are the forward years? Well, I think it will depend on what the projects are that we actually undertake with the government, uh, the Northern Territory government. But you must have some indication as to how far that will depend on the final investment strategy, Senator, and the ability for um, the, uh, the capacity for them to deliver um, a, a, a level of work in each so, year. Yeah. So, if, so if the planning is 18, 19, so we'll be able to come back. When do you expect the works to actually begin? Well, we anticipate that once the planning is actually determined, that we're hoping to commence works um, pretty much. Straight away, straight away after those um, planning works have been done. Um, we're very happy to come back to you, um, Senator, once we've got further information from the Northern Territory Government. And is, is that for both the Central Arnhem Road and the Buntine Highway? Yes, Senator. That's correct. Okay. In order to complete the project for both roads, will any land resumptions be necessary? Uh, we can't answer that question yet, Senator. Why is that? Uh, because it will depend on what the projects are. When do you think you might know? When the planning's finished in 1819. Has Infrastructure Australia assessed and approved anything in relation to both roads? Uh, there isn't a business case for either of those two projects. Um. And is the Northern Territory Government required to provide funding? And to how much and have they agreed? Uh, so it's an 80 20 split on both of those projects. Of those projects. Okay. <coughs> it's come off 80%, 20% from the, from the state. And just uh, in terms of starting the discussions, when will that take place? We've already started um, um, ongoing discussions with the Northern Territory Government, Senator. Okay. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to go WA. Who's that? Uh, okay, yes. great, thanks. Uh, I want to ask about the Tonkin Highway gap upgrade the highway from Collier Road to Great Eastern Highway.